Today, we've been invited into one of the finest pet grooming facilities in my county, guys. And they have allowed us to come in behind the scenes and groom with them and experience grooming life through their grooming tables with the pets that they so greatly love and care for. Welcome to Shaggy Chic Pet Grooming Salon. Charlotte, the shit do. You want to say hello, gonna be... Charlotte? Oh, she's going to be so fancy. <laughs> <laughs> she gets ponytails, right? Yes, she does. Oh, and Charlotte. She gets her nails painted. Today we're doing purple. Oh, this is going to be fun. We can't wait. Charlie's a good girl. She's very used to having her photo taken, aren't you? Uh, <laughs> yes, she is very compliant. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Aww. I took her feet shorter than I normally would with you dogs did? like this, just because of the fact that she gets them painted. So you really want because, to show it off. Yep, we want to show it off and it makes it a little easier for me too, because I'm not, I don't have the most steady hand when it comes to painting nails. Yeah, so. you know, I, I'm not the, uh, I don't know if I've ever painted any client nails. I just never had anybody really ask for it. I don't have many. But there's a few here and there that yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, I agree. Especially with poodles. Yeah. I do love it on like poodles and I mean short-haired dogs. Like I had yeah. a I had a labradoodle yesterday that gets completely shaved down, and her mom had me do neon pink on her. That would be pretty. And that that looked really cool. And she's pure jet black. Yeah. Really oh, that would look awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, it was really. So, do you use a do you use a special kind of nail polish for dogs? That does, is it quick drying or it did? is quick drying. We've tried the War in London pens, um, and they're great like the first two times. Yeah, but they dry out very quickly, and then they're you just have to toss they're them. Very much of a pain. So mm. I like um, I really like Davis. Oh, brand. I, Davis! Um, yeah, they have a so. They really have their embellishments down, I yes. think. A lot of yeah. cool embellishments for the they, grooms. They have the most like variety of colors and theirs are all quick drying. Yeah, like, and they really ones. do and they really do dry quick yeah. for it. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to try it, but my own dogs are boy dogs, so I can't try it on <laughs> them. So I'd have to try it on a client dog. How about it, Charlotte? You're such a pretty girl. Amy, do you pluck your hair? Absolutely. You do. Yes. It's very controversial. Yes, it is. <laughs> How about you guys? Yes. Yeah. And no. It, Some yeah, dogs it, I don't. it depends. Yes. Only if it's necessary. I mean, Some I. Pet, like, Kapolka, the vet at the road, he yeah. does not ah, That's a bunch of crap. I'm sorry. That, I mean, that I, is, those ear hairs go all the way down. Let's mm -hmm. say in a poodle, all the way down to to the real sensitive areas in a in the ear, and all their buildup sticks to it and lays against that right. soft skin, and it causes irritation. Just like the dogs that get severe eye boogers, mm -hmm. when we remove that, mm -hmm. it's raw, right? Yep. It, it just makes no sense to not remove that hair. It's very controversial. No, that I don't do. Don't do that. I don't do that. Because I feel if they're not expressing their anal glands naturally, then it's more of a diet medical issue. And if anybody's going to be squeezing on the dog's anal glands to express them, forcing it to be expressed, it should be a vet. Because if they something goes wrong, you can actually explode dog's anal glands. Mm -hmm. And I just don't feel like us groomers should have to deal with that. I really don't. But we've been made to do it all these years, so people expect it, you know, from their groomers. Does she get tails? Does she get bows too, Janelle? She does, Aww. and she wears them all the time, so it. Her, she's <laughs> oh, so it gets a little tangled. Yeah, when she comes in. Yeah. Aww, yeah. A little bit of dematting to do. How often does she come in to see you? Um, 
We've gotten down to every six weeks because that's that seems to be her sweet spot for yeah. keeping her hair manageable. Yep. Those tools do help a lot mm -hmm. just to just to break up the mat. Yep. Instead of having to cut it out. <laughs> yeah. That one's a little too big. And that they better watch out. And especially she got lots of footage of her. I know that's why I said she's the star of the show. And then she uh um she just turned two. She had had yeah, the top of her head was her was probably like this long. Really? And they decided to take it off to try something different. And we did. And now we're growing it back in because she oh, just loves the those dog ponytails. Tails, so yep. I I like them too. But it's cool to try some mm -hmm. new things, you know. Yep. And it's hair, so it grows back. Yeah, it grows back. Yep. <laughs> There's another one. Yeah. What are you using, Sam? This is a uh, three-eighths of an inch. Oh, yeah. Snap-on. That looks very nice. The first time I groomed her, I did a three-quarters of an inch. So it's a couple steps up from this and yeah. her mom. Too much hair. Too much hair. Yeah. So it's, it's, still it's good cute. to start big. You can always go shorter. Exactly. Yeah, the hair back system is just wonderful I for, love it. for clipping. They use the clipper vac system here by Romani. And this also, doesn't this couple as a force dryer? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Janelle has the hose over there for the hookup. It's supposed to be a pretty nice force dryer, too, from what oh, I understand. Wait, you're, Janelle, do you think? Oh, you're talking about the actual force dryer, not the one, because this hooks up to that and you can use it as a blow dryer. Right. Well, I mean, it turns, it couples into being a force yeah, dryer. Yeah, but they have the big Oh, daddies. they do have another, yeah. Tick. I'm coming. Aww, Hershey, you have a tick. Oh, he really does. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Really in there. Look you at have that. a tick oh, piece? It's really in there. Oh, I'm gonna have to grab it from you. Okay, baby. Okay, I'll stay with you. I'll stay with you, Hershey. Aww, he's a good boy. Oh, he's God. a good boy. We're gonna get that tick out of there. Oh yeah. Good job. There it is. Let's Good see boy. that bugger. Ew. All gone. Good boy. Oh, that's, that's much, so much better. She says, I didn't even know that I brought friends with me today. <laughs> Ponying up Charlotte. Oh my god. That looks so good. Yeah, so you a know. Of where we're going. Yeah. Then you know what's left is what needs tidied up. That does look really cute. Aww. <laughs> So we're doing hers purple for spring. Oh, that's pretty. They're, uh, hers are a lot easier to do because they're white, so it's a lot easier to get the color to. That looks so pretty. To pop. Oh, it looks so pretty. And I they also look like, like little Tic Tacs. I know. <laughs> I'll also because she gets them done every time she comes, so there's color on. Yeah. I actually will grind them and grind the color off and yeah. the texture from the grinding makes the color stick on better oh, so it's, and stay it's a, on longer it's a win win situation that's smart oh that looks so good charlotte you are so fancy and it's it looks so easy to work with with it being on a pen applicator yeah. and this is a davis product this one has actually a spree oh a spree okay mm -hmm. warren london makes them too but i like the esprit a bit better it's very nice to use it in, with that it's in a pen you know mm -hmm. since you're working with a dog yeah and you just like you just push the tip down and it 
it it's kind of like you Activates. know like a chalk like one of those chalk pen yes. markers it's kind of yes. like that oh yeah that's really nice and these are dog safe so like if they chew it or lick on it or something it's not gonna hurt them yeah <laughs> look at her i think she enjoys this yep she loves her little spotty <laughs> Charlotte, you're absolutely beautiful, honey. You're so beautiful. Yes. Such a good girl. Yep. She kills me. Oh, she does. She loves this. Mm-hmm. Oh. So not too many people re request for nail paint. No, not too many. But and Thankfully, she's perfect for it. She, she is. Still Can you imagine if you had a dog that was hard to work with yeah. and they wanted the nails done? It just would be a nightmare. Yep. Aww. Yeah, she's, she's perfect. Mm -hmm. And we're doing her mom requested leopard print scarf. So I'm going to see what I can manage for ah. bows to match. Still haven't figured that one out yet. Well, purple. yeah, because With she's purple. got purple nails. Mm -hmm. That's what I did on Maggie the other day. Yeah, oh, I, I think don't. that would look good. Look at that. I don't even need a second coat for this one. Wow. They look amazing. They do look good. Perfect. Charlotte, they look great. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to get the pretty face in there first. <laughs> Oh, right. so. nice job, Charlotte. And you guys are really loving the eye groom colognes too, aren't you? We are. Eye groom and Hydra are my favorite colognes. Yeah, are I they? Have. Yep. I do still have some old trusty favorites from Davis, but still. Davis has a lot There's of good products. That. And affordable too. It's one of the things I always liked about Davis. As a pet groomer, you know, they had good affordable products. Yep. Oh yes, definitely purple. That was a good call. Yeah, does that work? And it really looks good with the with the it leopard print. It does. Yeah, it works. See, your mama knows what she's oh, talking Oh, your about. mom's gonna be so happy. Look at Charlotte. I'm Charlotte. Oh, I, I, I know call my her name. Yay. She knows your name. Oh, beautiful. Look, Look at, at that. you. Oh, lady. She is proud. Now she can say I love you. Now let's see if we can get you to do this. She did it for me once. <laughs> Charlotte. I love you. I love you. I love you, Charlotte. I love you. I love you. She said no. I love you. I do. Oh, I love you. How about a kiss? Oh. I love you. I love oh. you. We almost got it. I love you. I love you. I love you. Oh my god. She's so cute. Oh my god. Oh, you're fabulous. Charlotte's mom can get her to say I love you very easily. And I was going to get this on film and my mic was actually still attached to the camera, but in the other room, so we can't hear what she's saying. But she literally is telling her mom that she loves her. So if you're not crying with joy right now, I mean, I don't know what to tell you guys. Get a heart. This is the best thing I've ever seen as well as it was just such a joy to witness the bond that the girls at Shaggy She have with their clients and their pets. This was just a wonderful experience and I'm so thankful to all of the girls for having me and inviting me into their world for a day. This is only the first video in a series of videos that I'm going to be sharing with you about my experience with Shaggy Chic Groomers. So stay tuned for all our future episodes coming. They're coming, guys. If you've enjoyed this video, smash that like button and let us know. And also subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the future videos coming up for you.